Hello, Gamer Nome is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the Magnet Fruit, unlock all its powers, and become pro. But before we start, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Nome when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to me, and this will really help us on making better videos. Where the actor slam on the dancing forward, there's your slam, there's the dump! Okay, so it's been a long time since I played King Legacy, so here it is, a new fruit, the Magnet Fruit, and hopefully, we will also be having this fruit in Blocks Fruits. Okay, so first, let's talk about this fruit in King Legacy, so let's eat it and start grinding. Guys, do you remember the chicken quest? You need to get three chickens, fried chicken, <laughs> one of my favorite food, in order to level up fast. So that's the first one, the location, there you go, in the terrace. Next one is here near the gacha, and last one is in the spawn point. Okay, so after getting or finishing this quest, check this out. Guys, 19 levels. So we're gonna do it again once more, and we'll get a total of 23 levels. Okay, so that's 24. Now we can start defeating Smokey, the one. The boss near the terrace so we're gonna use the skills so we have two skills right the gatling magnetoid and magnetic cage so here you go first is magnetic cage there you go and once our enemies inside the cage we're gonna use our z skill there you go make sure to hit it there you go guys just one combo and that's it not bad for a new fruit guys if you're watching one piece this is the fruit of kid right so here you go the stats defense 15 all stats in the power fruit I almost said blocks fruits so there you go guys, very easy. At level 30, we're gonna start defeating Tashi. Or Tashigi, right? So that's 1x. And Z skill, is it enough? You're gonna find out. There it is guys, just one combo and that's it. So guys, we're gonna keep on grinding here again. Hopefully you get the sword if you want. The Tashi blade, something like that. Guys, grinding here is really easy and fast. So there you go at level 50. I'm gonna show you my stats. There you go, defense 30, melee 5, again all in the powerful. Okay, next island. Next up is the pirate island. So here we need to defeat mobs. First, there you go, the clowns. Very easy, just one Z skill and that's enough. Okay, very easy again. So we're gonna grind the clowns until we reach level 75. But before we reach that level, surprise, surprise, we're gonna unlock our Z skill. There you go, dual magnetize. So here it is, boom, oops, we're gonna try it on the mobs, clowns, okay, there you go, one hit, anyways, at level 75, we can start defeating Buggy, the clown, <laughs> the clown, okay, the clown, he's called the clown here, so there you go, is one combo enough? Yes, it is, so that's just one Z and X skill, you don't need to use your C skill, but if you want, yes, you can use it to have more fun, right? Okay, so at level 100, we're gonna head to the Soldier Island. First, we're gonna target mobs here. Also, this is the area where you can buy the Soru with a skill trainer for 50,000 bellies, okay? So target commanders, again, Gamer Nom, one combo. No, guys, just one Z skill. You don't need a combo to defeat them. There you go. Okay, so grinding here until 120. Okay, so next up, target is the captain, the boss here. Actually, there are two bosses here. So first off, let's check the combo, 1Z, and C skill is enough. Okay, Z and C. If you want, you can use your X skill. There you go to trap him and additional damage. Next target at level 145, the Axe Hand or the Barbaric. So here it is, guys. I suggest you use long range attacks here. And good thing, all your skills are long range. So no problem, there you go. And we got a stainless jaw. Okay, so target here is level 200. Take note that we've skipped all the mobs in the next island. Okay, so again, 200 stats, melee 20, defense 100, all in power fruit. Next up, guys, Shark Island. Again, we skip all the mobs straight to Karate Fishman. I think this is one of the bosses here. Single target. That's the easiest way to grind, right? Not like in Blocks Fruits. We don't need mastery here, just stats to unlock the skills. So there you go, one combo plus one Z skill. So Z, X, C, and one Z. And that's it, okay? So target here, 230. And after this, everything will be a lot faster because of this. There you go, the Shark Man. So guys, check this out, okay? So we're gonna use our skills, right? Z, 
C and X. There you go. Let's wait for it. There you go. C and one Z skill because X is in cooldown. There you go. Okay. After that, check this out. We're gonna time it. One, two, three. Oh, wait. Let's check our stats. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Check that out, guys. Less than ten seconds. He already respawned. So again, grinding here is really fast. Don't worry, our cooldown is really short. Target here is level 300. So guys, on the next uh, island, we're not gonna fight the mobs there. We're gonna focus on the bosses. Okay, so chef, ship, target is dark leg. So let's check our combo if it is enough. Our ZXC. Okay, Z, I think we're too close. We're gonna use C and great distance. No, XX. <laughs> guys we missed it <laughs> Z skill okay that's enough actually just kind of easy again this foot is really powerful target here again 350 okay so next up at 350 we can start defeating the weapon man so a while ago it is the axe hand now the weapon man so as you can see that's Z skill X skill and C is it enough yes it is one combo there you go Target here is level 400. And once we reach that level. Oh, wait, the stats. The same. 100 defense, melee 20, and all in the power fruit. Next up, guys, Snow Island. Guys, take note that if you got hit here, you will easily die. Anyway, target here, no soldiers. Good news one Z skill is enough. And also, finally, we're gonna unlock our V skill at 1500 power fruit superior solenoid so i'm gonna show it to you there you go he's gonna raise a big uh, metal hand and hit the enemy with it damage check he can almost one hit a snow soldier okay anyway moving on at 450 king snow is our target here he is, here he is. <laughs> z skill okay more than half hp x skill C skill. Okay, that's enough. Let's try other moves. One Z and V skill. Is it enough? Z and V. Yes, it is enough. Target here, level 500. Guys, take note that once you reach level 500, you can start a new quest. Here you go. You need to defeat four King Snows. Hmm, this is new. Okay, again, four King Snows. You will gain 4 million experience. Check that out, guys. From level 501 to 500, I think it's 16. Not bad, right? Okay, anyway, moving on. Next target is the little deer. So here it is, Chapa. Let's try it. Z skill, okay. okay. Z skill. Okay, that's it. Two skills, enough. Let's go. Target level here is level 525. There you go. Now I think we're moving on to the next island. And that island is a desert island. Target here, first target is the Candleman. So guys, I suggest use long range attacks, which is really good for us, right? So one Z skill, C skill, we need to cage him, magnetic cage, so that he won't be using his skill. Okay, so one more Z skill, that's enough. But if you're having a hard time aiming, go outside and use your Z skill. Guys, since our X is in cooldown, we will just jump to avoid getting hit by his attack, okay? There you go, two skills, that's it. Target here, guys, is level 625. After this, the next enemy is a lot harder, but don't worry, bomb band, guys, you can burst him. Just one Z skill and one V or C, and that's enough, okay? Okay, there you go. Target here is level 725. And after that, there you go. Next target is the King of Sand. So I think this is Crocodile. So guys, make sure that you use your X skill on him because if not, he will be using his long range attack and he can one hit you because again, our HP is really low. So technique here, go inside, use your X skill, magnetic cage and that's it. He won't be using his skills. There you go. Okay, really easy, right? Yes, guys, and good news. Finally, we will be unlocking in this island our final skill. Again, requirement is 3,000 power fruit points. And the name of that skill is the Gigantic Magnetism. So it looks like uh, the skill of pain. That's not the skill. <laughs> that's, a sup that's the superior uh, whatever. <laughs> Here it is, the B skill, Gigantic Magnetism. So let's try it. 
So that's like Subaki, right? I I really oh no, or like Gara's skill, right? Okay, that's B. There you go. For the damage, just check it out. Almost dead. Let's use the V skill, and that's it. Okay. So guys, we've unlocked all the skills of the Magnet Fruit. Is it good? Should we continue this? Comment it in the comment section. So again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom. Gamer Nom out.